Hello guys, and welcome back. When we left off, we had successfully conquered the Republic of Twilight and Stars, and we are now once again at peace. I find that just letting my little states here manage themselves is more efficient than, yeah, basically having to uh, manage them personally. So for all this is ours. Hostile fleet engaged. Oh, well, I don't want fleets. I ordered them to attack some drones. I wonder how long they'll get and last. The drones, that is. Pop, pop. Situation log updated. Hostile fleet engaged. I wonder how long the stations will last. Pop, 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 pop. Situation log updated. Oh, that was easy. Oh, also with the, um... Yeah, with this area finally opened up, we can actually start exploring this area, which is nice. System survey complete. Research complete. Right, so Hostile now, fleet engaged. I'm going to declare war on them. I'm going to the Black Republic. And apparently, since they're not my vassal, I can't count on them to declare war on anyone. So, so I lose out on their military force, basically. Situation log updated. Also, by declaring war on them, I'd be declaring war on this giant faction here. Probably doesn't like me now. Actually, no, it appears they never like me. What about these guys? Oh, the technology level is so high, that's kind of scary. The also consisting of a huge amount of humans, apparently. Oh, because they're overlords of the town empire, so... Like, if I declared war on them, I'd be declaring war on all these nations, yeah. Wait, let's see here. Yeah, that's a bad idea. Yeah, so they turned the town empire, my custom empire, into a vassal. Don't know what to think about that, as so it's kind of sad. But what I am going to do is I'm going to need to make them my... The Senate will review this proposal? You don't actually think that you have a choice. Really? System survey complete. So they actually think that they can stand against us. Actually all vests are disloyal. So we can't integrate them into our empire, basically. Oh, it would cost us a lot of influence. That's pretty good. So we can turn a... Fasses and integrate them into our empire, basically. Or we can release them. And we can turn, um... What is it? 
tributaries into vassals, basically. I don't know. I kind of like the Republic, but we could definitely, oh, we're maxed out on that, so it's time to make the Super Star Destroyer. Yay. Yeah, that's going to take a while. Hopefully it'll be done before the video, not the end of the video. That's pretty cool. Apparently. I don't know, I like them having the independence for the most part. Yes, they do in fact help us with all wars. Well, I wouldn't mind in um taking them off the field for the most part. I don't know, because like there's a limited capacity, so there's actually there's really no reason to integrate them into the little empire, so Trying to figure out a way to make them more loyal. This one I can't think of anyways. Wait. Where's your disloyal? How long do we have to control you guys before you guys like see the benefits of being a part of the Empire? I think about it this way. All well, humans except for those dirty zeros up there. Can't be that bad. We have an awesome fleet that is just rampaging through. Situation log updated. Situation log updated. Yeah, why wouldn't you want to join us? Never understood that. I don't know, maybe they, maybe they're just envious of how awesome we are. That's probably it. Four pieces looking quite solid. It's so powerful that the well, old enemies would never dare attack us. Research complete. Start putting down some fortifications here, so we don't have to deal with any threats coming in from that area. Because for the most part, we have this giant little buffer zone between all core and the enemy.
Situation updated. Okay. Well, what that was all about. Oh, we didn't even get a chance to use our awesome transport fleet. Now that I realize it. System survey complete. Let's get this in. All this action has been just taking place in like not even a fourth of the known galaxy. Hell, we have these juggernauts, the Solventy, and the Hem Gen Gemini. So those are going to be pretty hard to take down. So much money now, it's unreal. Let's look into the plants that we need it. You all construction complete military facilities. Yeah, as you can see it's going down, that means that they're actually building facilities or so on their own. So we don't have to build them for them. I'm kind of curious. The ship designer will open up without crashing the game. I want to check something out. Cause like there's different hull types for the same class of ship, so I wonder if they have a oh, barely not. So you can't choose between like this ship or like an executive class. Oh well. I mean, they had fighters, apparently. Look at all that shielding. That's terrible armor, but it has a bunch of hell hole points and shielding that is very scary. What's System that? survey complete. 4,000 shields. 3,000 shields. Lock shields. Wait, no, it actually doesn't have that much shielding. This is the most part. It's just power has so much power, that's insane. It was a waste for the most part. All the power. Colony established. There we go. That's much better. Now it's impenetrable. Just cannot die. Ships upgraded. power 
the Empire is truly limitless. Oh, that is just awesome. Ships upgraded. Construction complete. System survey complete. Ow. Ships that upgraded. It is so sad that there is terrorists that just continuously attack our planets here. I think I, I put enough into just uh, putting, putting them down instead of just suppressing them through media propaganda. Yeah, I should keep them down. Just a bunch of uh, propaganda, obey, pay your taxes. Oh my goodness, it's almost done. Oh, this is gonna be so cool. Research complete. Ah, two researchers at the same time, nice. Increase the power to Ships capacity. upgraded. Construction complete. Federation. Oh, super Star Destroyer. Oh, it still needs to be upgraded, apparently. Unless they changed it back. Don't tell me they changed it back. Oh, that's true. No, it has like all this power, but it doesn't have any shielding. So, which is it's, it's, it's stupid. I'm going to have to make my own ship, apparently. Construction complete. Let's see ya. System survey complete. There we go. Call it Mark One. Unfortunately, it seems that they don't think it's worthy of being updated. Well, I guess we'll have to get rid of this design. Construction complete. There we go. Ships upgraded. Construction complete. That's better. Mark one class. Oh, it's beautiful. There's so much shielding. It's insane. So much shielding, so much... So much firepower. We really just want to test this thing out, but we don't have complete. anything to test it out on. Yeah. The fifth fleet. 
Congratulations, you've been promoted. Where are we going? Ugh, I don't want to start a border conflict just to test out a weapon. And, and we don't have any targets. Ah, oh, that sucks. Like that, it has a firepower of... Does it really have a firepower that much? I thought it would be way more powerful. Okay, there's a bunch of ships, I don't, or a bunch of weapons, I don't know why. It's so weak. I don't know. Ah, I like this, this, uh... Oh, yeah, it's like a last wood belt around it. Never get to appreciate the little things when you have a galactic white empire. I don't know, wherever you sit on the border, yeah. Yeah, you guys are just, they're just chill on the border. Yeah. Construction complete. Look at that thing, it's just, this is awesome. Awesomeness incarnate. Well, I like how with all the Imperial designs, so they're basically the same shape. Except for the, and, and, and they, they may change the amount of engines on, number of reactors. Why is this thing holding still? But anyway, like they they always have the same command bridge or so, like like the command bridge up here, so it's always the same design. It's like they build like probably billions of those command bridges and it's and we're like heck, we, we, we don't have enough ships or so or we're not gonna make that many star destroyers or so we need something to do with these. And like, hey, I have an idea. We're making a super star destroyer. Why don't we put the same command bridge on it, and, and the guy got a promotion, so... Got a promotion to, like, work, work on the... the Death Star or something, and then it blew up. So, it looks like this ship is so powerful that it cannot, cannot stop moving without the... being... making... I, I, I don't know without its gravity crushing itself and its awesomeness, so we're just gonna leave it alone. Be special, I guess. Incoming transmission. What's up? Oh, great. Do you like us now? Loyal, yes. Good. What do you want? I know that we're not really using any of these. What, do they have better technology than we do? They have better technology than we do. Why can't we just take their technology and so really exploit it? Like, that's just silly that they can have better technology than we can, but they are all vassal, and we are not allowed to, tech, to take their technology. Like, what? That doesn't even make sense. So, they'll still disloyal. 
they are still this one. except for the Galactic Republic. Absolutely hate all gods. We have a special star su super star destroyer that won't stop moving. Oh, it stopped moving. Nice. Look at that. That is just... It's absolutely beautiful. Okay, we're gonna build a frontier. Wait, why can't we build a frontier station there? Like, there we go. Fortifying positions here. declare war on us just because of the fact that we have such a bigger fleet than theirs. We're gonna probably declare war on them because they are our greatest threat. We can take out the Confederate line left but planet or so and the sovereignty so nothing will prevent us from taking full control of this northern hemisphere of the galaxy. Ships upgraded. Construction complete. Like that, so I can just make any modifications I want. This is like my own personal little star sure I can change to my whelm. If the game will let me. Here. And those U UV lasers. Pretty nice. Oh, I am a little tired of missiles being a threat to us. So doing that should eliminate any missile threat. Also, nuclear missiles don't do any more damage than the on torpedoes. They do way less, in fact. Taking them off would be nice. Taking them off and 
Let's see. Uh, We'll keep the leopard cannons as well. Well, it's nice to have batteries. Hey, cool. Got a new design here. Ships upgraded. Construction complete. I still like it how it says that this ship over here is just like lawfully unprepared for anything. Unemployed, you're just doing something wrong. Also, finally, the rebellions have ceased in this area. Rebellions have ceased, and now there is nothing but peace. Hey, that rhymes. this video here. I hope you guys enjoyed it and I will catch you guys next time.